Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video. So for today's glittery look, we're gonna start by applying some tape onto the corners of our eyes. And this is so that we'll get a nice sharp line when we apply our shadows and liner later. Next you want to go in and apply some kind of an eyeshadow base. And I'm using the Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer in the shade Toasted Almond today. Now for eyeshadows, we want to keep it simple, so I'm going to use my Soft Glam Eyeshadow Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm going to apply the shade Orange Soda all over my eyelid. Then for my inner corners, I am going to highlight with the shade Tempera, which is a nice matte highlighting shade. Next, we're just going to add some definition to the crease with some darker shades. So I'm going to mix Burnt Orange and Sienna from the palette and I'm just going to add this into the crease and the outer corners of my eyes. Now I'm going to start creating the winged liner and for this look we want to start with a really dark black smoky liner. So I'm going to apply the black eyeshadow from the palette called Noir with a very small eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to create the shape of the liner. Then once I have the shape that I am happy with, I am going to go in with the black Inglot gel eyeliner in the shade 77 and I'm gonna apply this close to my lash line and blend up into the shadow if that makes sense. We want it to be the darkest close to the root of the lashes and then fade up into the shadow. If you want to, you can use the gel liner to line the inner corners of your eyes as well, but I find that the only liner that stays in my inner corners without smudging is the Fenty Fly Liner, so that's what I'm gonna use. Now this part is so satisfying, we're gonna peel off the tape to reveal our super sharp liner. If your foundation sticks to the tape like mine did, don't worry, you can just fix it with some foundation. Now we're gonna apply the glitter and this glitter is by Feline Lashes. I don't think that they sell this anymore, but you can just use any cosmetic glitter. But basically, I'm gonna apply this glitter adhesive from Anastasia Beverly Hills on top of the liner that I created and then I'm gonna press the glitter on top of it before it dries. This glitter adhesive was really good because I didn't see a single glitter fall off throughout the day and as you can see, some of the glitter pieces were quite chunky so I'm definitely gonna use this when I do glitter looks from now on. For the bottom lash line, I just wanted a light shadow, so I applied the burnt orange eyeshadow shade from the palette. Now I'm just going to go in and apply some mascara and my favorite lashes, Russian Blue from Feline Lashes. We are zoomed out and now I'm going to apply the Peachy Love Blush Trio from Anastasia Beverly Hills onto my cheeks and then I'm going to go in with the Marc Jacobs Omega Glaze Luminizer in the shade Guilty and highlight the high points of my face. For lips, I'm going to do my favorite nude glossy lip and that is with the matte lipstick Peachy by Anastasia Beverly Hills and the Fenty Gloss Balm in the shade Fenty Glow and that is it for this look. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys again next week. Bye!